out here. It's so much fun. Isn't it fun? Yeah. <laughs> All right, welcome to LACC Presents. This is the Music and Trends Show, and I am your host, Jenny Eloise Ryu, and I am so excited to be here. We have some good stuff going on today with Carlene Williams, who is going to do a mini showcase for us here on this very stage. Um, she's an artist who grew up on the border of Utah and Arizona, and she moved out here to Los Angeles about a couple of years ago to pursue musical performance here and be an artist, which is kind of, you know, it's a journey, and we're going to take the journey with her today. And if you would join me into welcoming her on this very stage, Kerleen Williams, everybody. Hi, how's it going? Good, thanks. How are you? Very good. good. Very good. Yeah. <laughs> it's nice to see you again. You too. I was so pleasantly <laughs> surprised when yeah, I found that you were doing this too. And I was pleasantly surprised <laughs> that you were going to be the guest. It's just mm -hmm. like it's meant to be. We yep. actually know each other from the musical department mm -hmm. where we used to take music classes together here at LACC and here we are today again. Yeah. What a small town. I know. It's so cool seeing like this department too because I mean of course I knew it existed but like I've never been in here and that I, that's why it was that much more pleasant when I saw you here. I was like oh yeah, awesome. she's still Friendly here. Face. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. In any case you're going to do two songs for me, uh, for us. See, yeah, it's, it's, I'm so excited. I'm just like, those it's are just my songs. It's just for me. <laughs> no, it's just for me. I'm not selfish. No, just kidding. <laughs> and here we are. Please give a warm round of applause for Carlene Williams. Aww. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. So, yeah, it's no secret that I'm Carlene Williams. <laughs> but um, this is Half of Me. This is the title of my song. So, here goes. I can't sleep in the night because in the sky are clouds that reflect the city lights in the countryside I still see in the dark because of the stars in the city they're only on the boulevard Oh, 
since the colors cast through the prison. Here, where the clouds are clear, the only sound I hear is the cricket's cry of advice. I still don't sleep. This next song is not the other half of me, unfortunately. We broke up, and everything bad that happened was um, in October. And uh, so I thought that was just an interesting observation, so I wrote about it. So here we go. I remember you in our spring of you. We didn't meet again till August. Then we crossed wings near Thanksgiving And by Christmas we were flying together Like birds of a feather You said forever Now we're far over We didn't make it past October Spoke of love all the time, yet I had no Valentine. I didn't hear you until your June birthday, too long after mine in May. And all you could say was June, honeymoon, baby boom, and I just want a honey. October passed too soon And my grandma passed Speaking of who Where were you When she died and when I Cried So did the sky And though I'd been Wide-eyed You were nowhere Near my side This past October should have known my pumpkin would just get smashed. Even Cinderella had us last longer than that. Even after a fall, you're still not sober. Yet I'm the one that's black and blue all over. Your green ain't gonna get no gold. a little bit about um, the first song that you performed half of me mm -hmm. and I was really touched by that song that there was something about that song it seemed like it came straight from the heart yeah. and you know like I wanted you to talk a little bit about the inception of the song yeah I like that word inception because it's you know has to do with dreaming and you know I mentioned dreaming in in the song but it's not about dreams although you can see things when you dream that you know you don't see in reality and you know a lot of people like to make reality or like glamorize reality more mm -hmm. but like I think that there's validity to both sides of, of everything you see you know what I mean and so yeah. it was just um, trying to focus on things that are outside of our physical um, our visible spectrum because like um, I've been kind of bullied by some people that are close to me um, because I'm blind in one eye, you know, like, 
it was kind of, you know, I, I suffer from it already and they kind of just like insult to injury mm -hmm. would add some things. And so that's why I wrote this song is to just kind of show what I do see and have a positive light on it. So. And you do, <laughs> you do through that yeah, wonderful so song. It came from the stars in my mind <laughs> more than anything, yeah. So. Awesome, awesome. Mm -hmm. Also, I think your music is influenced uh, by ambient music and chordal music rather than what's really commercial out here on the radio. Can yeah, you talk yeah, a little yeah. Bit about that? Yeah, um, I mean, I was taught music at an early age by my mom, but it was kind of just like, you know, really religious and, you know, folky, but even the religious stuff had um, folk tunes to it, I could, I guess you could say. Mm -hmm. And, um, yeah, so that was my, that's what I've been influenced by as I learned music. But then I started listening to popular music and, you know, that's what made me want to do music as a career. Um, but it's not what influenced me. So I was like, I'm somewhere in between, I guess. Okay. <laughs> I'm like aiming for like this pop punk sound, but because I'm coming from something totally opposite, I'm just somewhere right. in between. <laughs> awesome. So. As yeah. I was watching you, I, I saw a great deal of Pat Benatar and Stevie mm. Nicks, women that I really respect mm. as artists because they put themselves bare on stage. You know, you see their bare soul when they're performing. And yeah. I was wondering what kind of musical influences you had since you were talking about influences just a second ago. Yeah, I mean, as far as like as a songwriter and with guitar and stuff, um, just more of the alternative female singers you'll hear like on alternative rock stations that are like millennial, like post 2000. Cause you know, I've heard those names, but I'm not familiar with the music, but that's very flattering. Cause I know they're like notorious. So <laughs> yeah. Um, but just like Michelle Branch, Kelly Clarkson, you know, Avril Lavigne, of course, she's my favorite, you know, and just more recent, Right. I try to aim for a sound like that. But. Strong young women. <laughs> just yeah. like you, Colleen. Aw, thank you. <laughs> you too. Ah, no, thanks. <laughs> do we love each other that much? <laughs> I, I think love, we do. I have love. Yeah. <laughs> I have love for you too. Mm -hmm. um, I wanted to mention a little bit about you performing here in LA. You've performed at the House of Blues, you've performed at El Cid, and you perform at the Viper Room, the Viper Room, which is room to a lot of rock legends. And how do you feel about yeah, that? Yeah, I actually performed in the acoustic lounge there, but um, I mean, still, still, yeah, still, and yeah, um, I'm very excited. I'm like, ooh, I want to come back now. You know, now that I've met people, and I definitely will be. I'm like aiming for the main stage there. So, yeah, awesome. that's just the beginning, and now there's no stopping. It's so. just the beginning, <laughs> exactly. Yeah. If you could tell your followers and people who are watching us tonight a little bit about your Instagram or your Twitter, where they can catch up with you for your next shows or whatever is okay. happening in your musical yeah. life. Yeah, I've made sure I have like a little bit of everything, and so I, um, I, I use Facebook the most. That's Carlene Williams Music on Facebook. Um, my Twitter is Carlene Williams. My Instagram is Carla Willia, C-A-R-L-A-W-I-L-L-Y-A. Um, my YouTube is Carwill4, C-A-R-W-I-L-1-L, number four, and the SoundCloud is also Carwill4. So. That's a lot of links <laughs> for us. This is great. Thank you so much for Little coming kitty. on the stage of Music and Trends today. Please yeah, give a warm round of applause to Carly Williams again. Yeah. 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 Hey. Wasn't she great or what? Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching us tonight, and we'll see you next time. Thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs>